Uh, Riot has just gone off to radio as well. It's gone to all the urban radio stations in America. Um, and I think the plan was, because Down is a very poppy track, you know, and Riot is a bit cooler and, it's, you know, it's a bit on that side. And I wanted America to be able to hear both sides of what I can do. You know, I like to have fun on tracks like, you know, the, the club tracks like Down. But also there's that other side of me which does the mid-tempos and the slightly sexier stuff. And I really wanted them to hear that. And, um... So I'm really happy that we kind of did like the double attack. So, you know, uh, uh, Down has now um, hit pretty much all of America's uh, rhythmic stations. And it, uh, I was really happy actually it got number one most added uh, right. across Amazing. the country. Yeah, so that was a huge start for me. And, um, and now it's just going to go to all the top 40 stations as well. So, as I said, man, it's just, it, it's a very different ball game, man. In England, I don't even think we have 65 stations, but that's just... How many have playlisted me already in America? Mm. Do you see what I'm saying? So big market, big it's market. a huge, oh, it's it. crazy. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. Now, to to sell a track, a lot of times it always helps to have somebody else with you. Of course. Like you have Lil Wayne. Yeah. Uh, you thinking about redoing those two songs or one of those songs maybe with somebody else? Yeah, maybe but, get some interest. Well, or? it's interesting that you asked that, actually. I think we're, we're we're planning to put a rapper on um, on Ride It. Um, which is something I always really wanted to do from the beginning because I can, there's I can a... do that if you need me. Really? Yeah. Uh, I mean, what I thing is, I'm gonna. If you need me, I'm yeah. Gonna... Just, I just want to. So you one sing and rap? Yeah. yeah if you're you so if talented, you bro. I'm always. You, just... you are a very talented guy. Thank you. Um, yeah. Again, I'm gonna say no. Okay. Just sorry about that. Sorry. Okay. Yeah. Well, just. Can't it's do just. It. Yeah. Fair enough. Fair but enough. But I mean, you're you're probably quite busy anyway. I am. Studio, just a lot. I mean, I've got. I've got. Just to let you know the quality of the work that I do it just comes out of these mega it's brand. Beautiful. I do it on the streets. It's great. With, with the feedback and everything. Really good. I love it. Okay. It's, it's great. You know, we don't pay him to be here, actually. He just kind of comes in. We can't get him to stop coming yeah. here. <laughs> <laughs> he really has no discernible skills. Are you serious? Uh, you are looking at... Yeah, getting... I think we're going to get a rapper on Ride It. Um, who, do you, any idea who? There's a couple who are who are really wanted in mind. Uh, I'm not going to... Flow Rider, maybe? No. I think it would be someone more like Fab. Okay. Um, it would be the fab. I'm hopefully getting a, a joint in with Drake as well, uh, seeing as his, he's now signed to, to the label as well. He's, so we're label buddies, so that makes it a lot easier. Um, is, but, he, is he with Rihanna, by the way? Do you know, do you know that? I think he is, yeah. Okay. I, think, I don't know for sure, but I think he is. I mean, he's been spotted a lot of times yeah. with Rihanna. Out and Have about. you spotted him with Rihanna? I spotted Rihanna actually. Oh. And the, that's the, another funny thing about New York is like you bump into people all the time. And I was um, there's this you know there's this little spot that we go to sometimes called Tillman's, and um, uh, she was there. Rihanna was there a couple of weeks ago, and just hanging out though. No one harasses them. Do you know what I mean? Right. So it's very cool. Yeah. Say hi. Yeah, you just go over and say hi, and it's fine. And introduce yourself. Yeah. Love to have you on my record sometimes. Which is exactly what I said. Well, I was going to say... So cliched, but... Uh, female art, <laughs> if you could choose a female artist to collaborate with you right now, who would it be? Uh, it would be Beyonce. And it will always be Beyonce Start until... Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not aiming high then. No, <laughs> uh, would you ask Jay-Z for permission? Man, that's... You know what's pretty funny is that... There's like I'm one step, just one step away, because the dude who cuts Jay Z's hair cuts my hair, oh, and really? I keep cool. on trying to say one degree. Of just, Jay -Z. just play just him, it. just play him. See, see what he says. Play it subtly in the background while you're giving him a trim. Right. But I don't know. It's um. I've seen Jay Z's hair. It doesn't take long. It would have to be a very fast. Well, play. this is what's so funny. Those guys, like, uh, he cuts like um Pharrell as well, and he actually. Thing is, I'm not like I would never be like, I need to fly you over to get my weekly cut, right? Yeah, sure. Whereas they fly him wherever they are. Like, if they if he's in London doing a show, Jay-Z will need to get, like, just a shape up. Man. He's flying him over, yeah. Good job. What does a Pretty haircut nuts. from Jay-Z's stylist come Oh, from man, you don't even come want on. to come know. On. No, for me, I'm good, because, I mean, like, I don't pay that insane rate, because... But this guy gets to say, hey, I cut Jay-Z. If you fly like, him out, uh, you're looking at a couple of thousand dollars. Well, yeah. What if you're just For just a, a haircut. Have you come into the shop 15 bucks? Really? Oh. Brilliant. <clears throat> Great. Easy.